Welcome to A Little Extra Practice. I'm Dr. Thomas Little. Today we're working on converting improper fractions to mixed numbers. Let's start with a real life example with this word problem. Maria ordered pizza for her friends. Unfortunately, they weren't very hungry and now she has a lot of pizza left over. To save space in the refrigerator, Maria wanted to move all the leftover slices into one pizza box. Was this possible? The first thing we'll need to find out is how many slices of pizza Maria has left over. So I will simply count them. Maria has nine slices left over. The next step is how many slices of pizza can Maria fit into one pizza box? Four, five, six, seven, eight. Maria has nine slices and she only has eight available spaces in the pizza box. What Maria has is an improper fraction. An improper fraction is when the numerator is greater than the denominator. An improper fraction is greater than one whole. So right now, Maria has more than one whole pizza. The next step is to set up the problem. We have nine slices over eight spaces. Nine is a numerator, eight is a denominator. Let's go ahead and divide. Eight can go into nine one time. One times eight is eight. Subtract, we get one. One remainder, one. This is where we need to convert the remainder. We have one as the whole number. The remainder is going to be the new numerator. So that gets put over here. The divisor is going to become the denominator, and that's going to go over here. So we have one and one eighth. So recapping what we did, define the mixed number, divide the numerator by the denominator, the top number by the bottom number, the quotient becomes a whole number. The remainder is the new numerator, and the divisor slides over and becomes the denominator. Use the example on the top left corner to help you solve these three problems. Let's go ahead and take a look. First problem, 17 over 3, 17 thirds. Convert that into an improper fraction. 17 becomes a denominator, 3 becomes a divisor, divide, 3 can go into 17 5 times, subtract, and we have 5 and 2 thirds. Next one, 25 over 8, 8 is the divisor, 25 is the number being split up, 8 can go into 25 3 times, remainder 1 out of Eight, three and one eighths. 43 over seven. Seven is the divisor. Seven times six is 42. Subtract, we get one. So the answer is six and one seventh. The improper fraction to mix number for all of these. Thank you for joining me on a little extra practice. I'm Dr. Thomas Little. Please subscribe and I'll see you next time.